This is a story of a low-status female hyena who found a loophole in the social order of her clan and climbed the social ladder to become the ultimate alpha female. A group of scientists had for many years followed a clan of hyenas in Kenya's Maasai Mara National Reserve. Part of that clan was Waffles, a female hyena with the lowest rank of the clan. The alpha females harassing her cups, and she often took a beating by the most powerful hyenas of the clan. Until one day, Waffles had enough. Hyenas live in a matriarchy with up to 80 animals. The females are in charge and the clan is organized in a strict and usually unshakable hierarchy. Alpha females in the top of the hierarchy eat first, when a prey is killed, which makes them stronger of healthier than the lower status females, who only get the leftovers. It ensures their offspring better chances of, not only surviving, but also occupying places high in the hierarchy. Often there are even royal families, where the status of leader is inherited from mother to daughter. This was also the case for this clan of hyenas. So much the more unusual was the process the scientists could observe in the years leading up to Waffle's takeover in 2012. It happens from time to time that hyenas try to fight their way to a place higher in the hierarchy. But they usually only challenge animals that are above them in the ranking. Waffles applied a different and less violent strategy. Over a long period of time, she made relationships and built a network of alliances with other low-status animals. Before the alpha females discovered what was going on, the low-ranking animals, with waffles in charge, had become large enough to put them out of order. Revolution is not the only thing that surprised the scientists. The new leader of the clan maintained a good relationship with the animals at the bottom of the hierarchy and the researchers were able to observe how in several cases she helped feed cups of low-status females. When oppressed animals and humans come to power, they often end up introducing their own regime of terror. But not Waffles. She led the clan from 2012 until 2019, when one of her grandchildren took over as alpha female. Today Waffles is still part of the clan, and H has maintained a high status position. Thank you watching the video. Please like and subscribe for more content. And as always, remember waffles.